Okay, I just wanted to send this, make it available f for you guys in case you want to do some extra credit on the landmark Supreme Court cases. You might look at the Marbury versus Madison, one of the fundamentals of judicial review. Look at the case there. Make sure that you are on all of these, whichever one you choose, to make sure you have good facts presented and the title and the date, what's the main issue or the main question. For example, in McCulloch v. Maryland, the question on is the um, power to establish a bank. Now, I don't know if that's not anything that we've been talking about, but it is a landmark case. Gibbons v. Ogden, another 19th century early foundational case about the power of the Congress. And also, when you're when you're uh, presenting, uh, make sure that you summarize and the the conclusion. And if you can find information on the uh, how the justices voted nine to zero, unanimous, or eight to one, seven to two, six to three, or five to four, that would be good. Um, Including these here, of course, you can pause, rewind, and look at the um, basics of the case. But what I want you to do is summarize it in writing in notes that you can show me, but also to be able to present it, have some sort of uh, working knowledge of it so you don't have to look down at your notes too much. Hazelwood versus Kuhlmeyer, another uh, school versus uh, students. Uh, this one, freedom of speech. Engel versus Vital. Of course, this is the famous clause uh, of the First Amendment that's known as the Establishment Clause. In the red here, I've got Establishment of Religion Clause. This is the great school prayer um, case from 1962. There's another one from 1986 on school, First Amendment rights. Texas versus Johnson, we talked about this in class, the flag burning issue. Matt versus Ohio, Fourth Amendment rights. We talked about New Jersey versus TLO. You could present this, just see if you can do it without looking down at your notes. Gideon versus Wainwright, rights of the accused, rights of a prisoner. And of course, Miranda versus Arizona.